Okay, let me jump around a little bit. Let me go actually back to the last episode because I was why why do we have all why do we have two people sacrificing themselves for the king? I, I could see one, right, and giving most of their body to the king, and then you know he gets the powers and all that. But I was like, why have two? Why what what is what is Tagashi trying to do here? What is he doing? And now I see it's the contrast poof with Yuppie. And Yuppie is straightforward. He's the one telling the truth. And he's done a lot, right? Because he now has this emotional, this sense of honor, right? That if I'd gone back on my word in a sense, I'd been defeated, right? This eternal emotional honor that he's now evolved into, which is disgusting, right, to a Chimera ant. So to Poof, this is outrageous. And even, and the king forgives him. And then even later, the whole thing about the traitor was one of the people that he let live. And Pooh is like, and a traitor too, and 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 Yuppie's like, look, hey, you know, I got no excuse. Here it is. It's it's the truth. And he keeps telling the truth, and the king keeps forgiving him. And there at the end, he's like, look, humanity is is a sacrifice, but you know, this it's a trial for us right now. We have to get through this in order to 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 elevate and get you know all the way to the top. And it's just that's just the way it is. Humanity is a trial for us. But all the way through this, Poof is like, no, this, there's the old Shemarian way, and that's, and that's going to be it. And, and he, he's like, look, even if they execute me, I, I'm going to do this. You know, I'm going to get rid of that girl so that, you know, her, her, how she infected him before, you know, veering him off even more toward humanity and his way of thinking. The whole thing with the board, getting rid of the game board and everything, so he doesn't remember that. And, the, and then, of course, but like I say, to God, he is so good at this. Uh, even when he gets, he poof thinks of one. Here's humanity. Now you remember this. We're good to go. I've got the girl out there. Like he said, now he's he's like, okay, I gotta get rid of the board. But and then, but the king's like, ah, there's something there. There's something missing. I, Tagashi's so good. He just keeps walking. All the the I mean, think about it. Is there action? There's some action, but there's tension. Just just amazing amount of tension all the way through. And they go. We jump to the to the end of this with Killua. The whole thing there, even there, you're sitting there. It's what they're thinking. It's like, okay, who's the target, right? Palm goes this way, opens the deal. Oh, I target this way. Uh, Killua, right? And the girl, Kamogi. It, you know, is it, now Killua's thinking it's either me or Palm. Who's your, you know, what's going on? Or is it somebody in there or what? And then he goes, he he goes to kill and Killua's like, okay, you're trying to kill me, huh? Not a problem. I'll protect the girl, and, and, and then he figures out it's trying to kill the girl. And then, okay, the whole thing with, you know, getting the girl to think that, you know, to slow it down, and, and you know, <laughs> that he's he's an enemy, something's wrong with you, and all that. That was just brilliant. But this was so good, and I'm so glad that the series is coming back. Like I said, this is all about poof, right, and how he's going to hold on to that Chimera Ant original way of thinking no matter even if he's going to die. Just an amazing, <laughs> this was just an amazing episode. And like I say, to think that it's that engrossing can pull you in that much when there's really not that much actual action going on. And I'm an action junkie and I feel totally satisfied with this episode. Anyway, <laughs> leave comments if you want. Uh, th that's what this uh, channel is about. Okay, Till next time, take care.